Welcome to whiteboard session. My name is Shin Chan Gang. I'm working for VIP deployment team. I'm responsible for the AMBA VIP, including IVD and IWB. Today's topic is interconnect workbench, the we call it IWB. The IWB has three functions. The first one, the UVM environment auto generation. The second one, is functional coverage. The third one is to analyze performance, such as latency and bandwidth. The IWB input is the IP exec, or the CSV format. The IP exec comes from AMBA designer, and CSV is generated by access red sheet. Access spread sheet to include whole design specification about duty. The IWB get the this the input and generate the UVM test bench. The after simulation, the the we can get the functional coverage. And we can get performance, the honest data. Now, the, this block diagram the, is a general SOC. The two ACE methods and the, a lot of XI methods, HB methods. The XI labels as a memory controller. And the, IOS labels. So if a user doesn't use IWB, the, the he have to the replace all the methods, all the labels, the with Cadence VIP. So even the IV interconnector workbench, interconnector workbench include yeah, the interconnect validator. This is a scoreboard, yeah, Cadence scoreboard. Yeah, so actually, the customer have to yeah, the connect the IVD port to each component manually. So also, the user have to define the old memory map of each component and actually make a computations the manually. Now, so the, without IWB, the customer has to spend much time to make up this kind of verification environment. And the IWB the include the routing model and virtual sequence virtual sequence and basic sequences basic sequences using the basic sequences the user can make easily their practical scenarios So actually, the IWB the include the performance monitor. The, through the performance monitor, the IWB can collect the performance data. Now the, actually, the user can find the which point is a critical path. So the which latency is the critical. And the so each interconnector, the how, mu how much yeah, the bandwidth is needed, we can figure out exactly the cycle base, clock cycle base. In conclusion, IWB is the most important yeah, the, for SOC interconnect verification yeah, the, and performance validation yeah, these days. 
Thanks for watching. Yeah. And see you next week.